Well, hello. It's so nice to see you. My name is Grandpa Mouse. If you'd like me to read the story to you, click the story button. If you'd like to play inside the story, click the play button. To go right to a certain page, click the pages button. green stuff sprinkler and I'm the stirrer right grandpa the champion stirrer better give it a whirl right now mmm this is going to be a wonderful spaghetti sauce children who can tell me what country is famous for spaghetti uh Illinois starts with the same letter Italy oh that reminds me while our sauce is cooking who'd like to hear a story from Italy I would me me I think you like this one it's about a young princess who breaks an evil spell it's called the princess and the crab What did you think? <laughs> I agree, Ferdy. But we mustn't be rude in the king's court. It was... Fine, father. Now may I go back to my fish pond? Oh, daughter, daughter. That fish pond of yours. Marina was the daughter of a king. She loved gazing into her fish pond more than anything in the world. Oh, daughter. But her father wished that she loved other things. See all the presents I brought. And look, the finest teachers in the land. Today, you shall choose one to study with. But Ferdy's getting dry. I need to get him back in the water. No, Marina. I insist. Choose a maestro to study with. I like gazing at the stars, at Jupiter and Mars, and the distant nebulars. Yes, gazing at the stars is fine, but thanks, I think that I'll decline. Mm. <laughs> ah! Oh, oh. <laughs> excuse me. Be a genius, oh, I blush. Though painting works of art is great, I don't think I'll participate. I like a song in any key, a soaring symphony, or a silly do re mi. Yes, music is divine, no doubt. But go ahead and count me. Oh, I said go! Whoa! 
Marina, there's a horrible witch who lives in this water. You're going to meet her someday. I you like whipping up a spell. Your fortune I can tell. Why at magic I excel. Yes, making magic looks like fun. For you, but not for everyone. Pay attention, Marina. You could learn something. Once upon a time... <clears throat> Ahem. I said... Once upon a time... Oh, forget it. Your Highness, can't you clearly see? Marina's grown too old for me. And swings. Something magic's going to happen in that fish pond, Brady. That's what I think. <sighs> this is fascinating, Papa. Now may I go? Ay, ay, ay. Have you made a choice? These are all your choices, not mine. I choose to go back to my fish pond. No, Marina. I won't allow it. You are coming with me to the village. Do I have to? Ah, surely you'll find something here that you like. Sometimes, the king would take Marina to the village. She saw nothing there that she liked. Until one day, a giant crab crawled up to her. Spices. You could learn to cook. I'll build you your own kitchen. How about a chess set? You shall have one of solid gold. <sighs> so there's nothing here you wish to own. Nothing. Niente. <gasps> Almost niente. He's beautiful. He belongs in my fish pond. I'll take him. Scusi, signorina. The crab is not for sale. Choose me, choose me, surely you can use me. Wait, you better buy another just in case you lose me. For bargains are you hunting? Well, then come to our Mercato. Here's a little something by some guy named Leonardo. Maybe something edible is more within your taste. There's nothing more incredible than my anchovy paste. Toys to play with cooking tools, gifts for your amore. If she's getting tired of jewels, then try my cacciatore. Take me, take me, hurry home and bake me. You can take the credit even though you didn't make me. Mmm, delicioso. Toy boat, 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 toy me, toy me, step right up and try me. You can poach me in a pot or pick a pan and fry me. There's a little 
little secret hidden deep within my shell. It wouldn't be a secret if that secret I should tell. But I'll give you a little hint and hope it serves you well. To find out who I really am, undo the magic spell. You don't need a crab. You would just spend more time at that fish pond. There's something special about that crab. What is it? What beautiful eyes he has. Please buy him for me. Please? I cannot sell him. No chance. Any chance. Oh, grazie, Papa, grazie. Now, can you and Ferdy be friends? Buono. Not so buono. Look at his eyes, Papa. Have you ever seen anything like him? Yes, on my lunch plate. Ah, 12 o'clock. Time for your riding lessons. There he goes. Come back, crab! Come on, birdie. The princess loved the crab with all her heart. She even felt lonely when it swam to the bottom of the pond. I wish I could swim to the bottom with him. But you can't swim, dear. You're afraid of water. Now, please, there are places to go, things to do. The Royal Duke of Tuscany is putting on a ball. Oh, look, the baby crayfishes are learning how to crawl. Excitement's in the air. Oh, Papa, I don't care. There's, There's a, a great big world out there. there. Why don't you join the other girls? They're putting on a play. It's a life and death pursuit. They could use a fresh recruit. There's, There's a, a great, great big world out there. there. Way out there. Way out there. Oh, Papa, can't you see it? Oh, daughter, can't you see it? Oh, daughter, can't you see it? There's a great big world out there. Love is sent by Cupid, aha, you think that's stupid, watch my arrow take a stab. The magic that convinces will be when our dear princess falls in love with a crab. Ooh! Hi. Missed me. Hey! Mmm. Ooh. Mmm. Ooh. Mmm. Ooh. Missed me. <gasps> per favore. Don't let him find me. Ah. <laughs> All right, where is he? Where is that criminale? Oh, oh, oh excuse me. <laughs> Till gets famous, then presto ever since. Every time you kiss a frog, you think you get a prince. <gasps> well, I got news to tell you. I'm sorry to report that you can kiss this frog all day and all you'll get's a wart. Ribbit. You can't swim, yet you spend your life dreaming about the water. Perché? Why? Why? Because it's so mysterious, so full of adventure. Because no one can buy it for me. Ah. <laughs> 
Maybe I should do other things, like my father says. But my heart just isn't in it. Greedy. Ay, 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 I just don't understand you, Marina. And I'm tired of trying. Keep your foolish fish pond. Papa, don't be angry with me. Please. Spend the rest of your life here. Marry that foolish crab for all I care. Fine, maybe I will. Marina watched and watched her crab. It vanished every day at noon, and she didn't know where it went. It disappeared again. How can this be? Hello, Marina. Maybe I can help you. Ferdy! Are you really talking to me? Maybe I am. Or maybe it's just your imagination telling you what you already know. I... 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 You know you love that crab more than anything. Even more than you love me. No, Ferdy. I love you both. It's just that my love for him is... different. I don't know why. Maybe I do. Wait here. I'll be right back. Never make an anemone an enemy. <laughs> Can you say that? <laughs> we know was a goldfish living right here in our pond. There came a man who sold fish and a guillo he was fond. He said, buy what a handsome face, so golden and so healthy. I'll take him to the marketplace, I'll let him make me wealthy. Now on the way to Parma, Guido took a little leap. He bounced right off a farmer and was swallowed by a sheep. You'll probably think we're lying, but up stepped an angry mule. Kicked the sheep, said Guido flying, now he's right back in our pool. Since when is a crayfish a fish? Since when is a hedgehog a hog? Since when is a radish a dish? That thing in the prairie's no dog. So don't call us a horse a horse. And don't call a jailbird a bird. And as for us crayfish, of course, we'd rather you start a new word. Ciao. Talking frogs? Disappearing crabs? Maybe I do spend too much time at this fish pond. Hold it in your hand, and think of your crab. What will happen? Brady. Brady. Ferdy, answer me! Brady. Ugh. Crab? Wherever can you be? Crab! What are you doing here? What am I doing here? Where am I? A splendid golden palace appeared before Marina's eyes. Suddenly, her crab became a 
handsome prince. Princess Marina! You will meet us later, little princess. <laughs> I'm really not that hungry. Pantaloni, <laughs> <laughs> minestrone, macaroni, and baloney, provolone, portaloni, rigatoni, and spumoni. And now, we come to the power of pizza. Tortellini, tetrazzini, tagliarini, and tortini, annavini, bucatini, fettuccini, and linguini. A picture is worth a thousand words. Welcome to my palace, Princess Marina. You? My crab? My eyes must be fooling me. Your eyes. How well I know them. You should. They've been gazing at you for weeks. Shh! Quick! Hide under here! I heard voices! No, your graciousness. I was just uh, talking to my spaghetti. You're lucky to have me for a wicked witch, you know. I let you become human every day and feed you a glorious feast. Yes, you're very kind, your graciousness. Try your daintiness next time. I want to hear how it sounds. And remember, I made you a crab and I'll keep you a crab if you don't watch out. Marina learned that the prince was under a witch's magic spell. It could be broken only by someone willing to put her own life in danger. Oh, my fork. Excuse me, your... <clears throat> daintiness? Oh, don't, you silly. <laughs> I'm Prince Anthony, and this is my castle. That witch tried to kiss me once, but I slammed my door and pinched her by mistake. So she turned me into a crab. Oh, my! I become myself for one hour each day, but I have to spend it with her. I can never break this spell. Round buffoon, my maps have found it. Sun and moon, they circle round that it. That map improves your facts, but what the earth? What moves around the sun? The earth, earth go round, round the sun. He, he can't! can't. He's Come coming round! He must be mad! Prince Anthony, Prince Anthony, there's been an awful switch. We woke one day and we were turned to statues by a witch. 
Prince Anthony, Prince Anthony, you'll always be our friend. But, but only when your spell is broken will our nightmare end. Prince Anthony, Prince Anthony, so silently we sing. The witch has turned us into stone, we cannot say a thing. Which is very powerful. She turned all my friends to stone. I want to help you, and I will. All spells can be broken. There must be a way. You'd have to go where she lives. The rocks of ruin. A dragon guards the way. A dragon? Then I shall learn to fight with a sword. That's not all. Then you have to play music so beautiful it will cast a spell on the witch. Worst of all... All right. What's going on under there? Quick, the jewel. Naughty little fork. Don't you ever run away like that again. Mmm, magnifico. You've done an excellent job this year, Marco. Oh, Marina! I didn't even hear you come. Marina went to her father right away. She told him that she wished to study sword fighting and music. Listen, dear, I am sorry about the way I... I'm sorry, too. Well, in that case, it's time you learned how wine is made. Come, I'll take you to the... No, Papa. I've decided what it is I want to do. I've seen the rocks of ruin where the witch lives. When you're a grape, you never escape. You're stuck in a crepe or a bottle of wine. Flattened by feet, oh what a treat. Life could be sweet if we stay on the vine. Let us, let us keep our perfect shapes. Please forget us, we're just sour grapes. It's not any fun to be dried in the sun and get stuck in a bun or a cinnamon bread. Or made into jelly by Mama Ginelli to somebody's belly that's where we're all led. But the she, out of nowhere, like a magic. <sighs> Tell me, Marina, what have you decided to do? A purple cow? Mamma mia! I'd better not tell Papa about the prince and the witch. He wouldn't let me help. I will learn to use a sword and play the violin. Ah, excellent. A, a, a sword? Did you say a sword? No, no. How about a sewing needle? I'll send for a... Get me Count Fiore. He's the finest swordsman in Italy. And for my music teacher, I choose Madame Zelina. I wish to start today. Yes, dear. And will you be needing anything else? F sharp. B flat, D, C. Sharp! I'll practice the violin now. 
again. Marina studied day and night. She practiced until her new skills were the finest in all the kingdom. Now, show me how to fight three enemies at once. She wants to learn things that are out of my reach. We're, We're too tired, tired teachers, too tired to teach. Teaching this girl is no day at the beach. We're, We're too tired, tired teachers, too tired to teach with a... <laughs> and a <laughs> Don't wake me up or I'll probably screech. Oh, I'm pooped as a preacher who's too pooped to preach. Life's no fun for a dummy, all wrapped up like a mummy. Swords get poked in your tummy, boy that feels kinda crummy. crab. Wake up! I must learn how to fight a dragon and cast a spell on a witch. One, two, three, four, one, two, three. Attenzione! This is how you fight three enemies at once. Take that! And that! And that! Fantastico! <sighs> Marina! Marina! Marina set off for the Rocks of Ruin. Her father begged to know where she was going, but she kept it a secret. Marina, what are you doing? Where are you going? I'm sorry, but I can't tell you, Papa. This is my own journey. Come back! Stop her! This is the way to the Rocks of Ruin, but you'll never make it that far. <laughs> Step into our wood. We dare you, we dare you, the walk will do you good. We'll scare you, we'll scare you, come closer if you would. We'll snare you, we'll snare you. We hope you've understood. The words can't prepare you. You'll never get to the Rocks of Ruin, Marina. A two-headed dragon guards the way. Let, Let the princess, princess go, go, Your Highness. I can't let you go, Marina. You'll be in great danger. 
Your Highness, it's not wise to use this sort of magic. Remove these chains at once! If you must go, then take him with you. Or him. Or at least some of these. Arrivederci, Papa. I might never see you again. Well, what do you think? Me too. The forest trail ended at a rickety old bridge. When Marina tried to cross it, a ferocious two-headed dragon attacked. You, you, you think you can handle a sword? She's going to fight the two-headed dragon? <laughs> this I've got to see. Even if she gets to the rocks of ruin, she'll never beat the witch. You can learn a secret about the witch, but first the dragon must be defeated. Don't eat me. I'm p, -p, p poison Oh! Ow! Now that's a headache! To defeat the witch, you must get the flower from her hair. 
Did you hear that? Get the flower from the witch's hair! This must be the place. Marina found the rocks of ruin and played as beautifully as she could. It seemed to be working. The witch was under her spell. Don't stop there. Please, finish the song. I'll finish if you promise me the flower from your hair. Oh, all right. Whatever you say. I'll take that flower now. I see a secret in your eyes. You're afraid of water, aren't you, my Dulce? Here, here's your flower. <laughs> We're Roman ruins, though we never roam. All over Italy we make our home. We lie and we wait through the heat and the cold and simply grow older, our story is told. Marina, you can do it. We believe in you. You can swim, you can do it, jump right in, get right to it, grab that flower and you'll see the witch's power lost at sea. Oh, oh, oh excuse me. <laughs> Oh, excuse me. <laughs> oh, excuse me. <laughs> Never make it. What's the matter, Dulce? Can't get into the swim of things. <laughs> I need that flower, but I can't swim. I'll never make it. Oh, oh, oh excuse me. <laughs> Do it, Marina. You can do it. I can't. I can't. Oh, the flower. It's sinking. Oh, Come on. 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 Almost there. princess were married. For her wedding gift, the king gave his daughter a palace all her own. But Marina wanted something different. Oh. Fighting dragons, swimming out to sea, marrying princes. <laughs> What became of my little girl dreaming at a fish pond? She grew up, and dreaming at a fish pond is how it started. Hmm, well... <laughs> I have a wedding gift for you. A brand new palace, all your own. And I shall fill that palace with wonderful things. You shall never be in danger again. 
I love you both. But is that what you think I want? Want a palace, isn't that a pretty joke? Psst, I'll give you my analysis. Her wheel has lost a spoke. Her watch could use a wine. Yes, her, her grinder grind doesn't, doesn't grind. grind. I, I hate, hate to have to say it, but Marina's lost, lost her mind. mind. Oh, my, Ooh, terrible. My. Very Dreadful. sad. They've given her a present which is wealth beyond compare. She'd rather be a peasant than the kingdom's royal heir? She must have come unglued. Well, why, why else, else this attitude? attitude? The, the bats, bats are in her belfry at the risk of being rude. It may take a little magic to rescue this wedding. It was foolish of me to offer you things, Marina. I know you better than that. I don't know how to please you, daughter. You've given me so much, Papa. I've never found out what I really want. I don't want a nice, safe palace full of things. Don't you understand? Either of you? Then what is your wedding wish? To have an adventure. See the world, take some chances. Follow our own trail. That sounds wonderful! Let's leave today. Ay, ay, ay. It's not easy being your father, dear. But uh, I'm learning. <laughs> Here is my gift to both of you. Follow it that way. But what about your little pond at home? You've got to stay. Or maybe we'll fly east. But we haven't had our feast. There's, There's a, a great, great big world out here. Stay right here. Stay right here. Oh, daughter, please don't go now. You've got to let me go now. Oh, You've daughter, got to please let don't me go, go now. now. There's a great Careful, but uh, not too careful. <laughs> uh, arrivederci. When Princess Marina followed her own wishes, she did lots of things she never thought she could do. That's right, dear. No one else can tell you what your dreams should be. I hope both of you follow your own. Well, it's time to leave Italy behind for now, but not completely. We've come to my favorite part of cooking spaghetti. What's that, Grandpa? <laughs> Eating spaghetti. <laughs> <laughs> If you'd like me to read the story to you, click the story button. If you'd like to play inside the story, click the play button. To go right to a certain page, click the pages button. Are you quite sure you want to quit? Well, I do hope you'll visit again very soon. Goodbye. <laughs>